Morning guys, so the first question today is to do with spots and your PMS time, so before you have your period, the late luteal phase of your cycle. So if you get spots in the later part of your luteal phase, it's quite a usual symptom for um, PMS. It's to do with inflammation. I personally can resonate with it a lot and I've found different ways for me to personally be able to work through it. So um, I have worked out that I need to be a bit kinder to my skin. So thinking from the outside in to begin with, like treating the symptoms, I have a very natural um, face wash bar that's got clay in it and that's really helped me i was trying out some different products and that was a good product for me i'll put a link in the comments below it is a uk store and it's a very small business close to me in shropshire but um i'll put a link in you can have a look for other things that are maybe more local to you if you're in the us or different countries and um, so it's always best to treat from the inside out um so in the second half of your cycle, you need to think of ways to metabolise oestrogen. So your liver metabolises oestrogen. That's what its job is. It's metabolising things. It's getting rid of excess things in your body, basically. So alcohol, for example, it's there. It's the waste disposal. It's the thing that sorts the waste out in order to dispose it. So to support your liver, it's good to eat lots of fruit and vegetables. So cruciferous vegetables um, support your hormone production yourself. So bolstering your body to help it to help itself. So thinking about having lots of fruits and vegetables. And I've definitely found I've been eating extra vegetables and fruits and whole grains this month it's probably been about a month now and i'm in my luteal phase i've got five days left of my cycle and i have no physical symptoms which is quite big for me um i think i did have a lot of rest in the first half of my cycle because i was poorly but i am feeling a lot more energized and a lot more calm and my body doesn't feel like it's fighting against itself which i'm sure some people can resonate with um so I'm reading this book at the moment, um, Is This Normal by Dr. Jolene Brighton. I highly, highly recommend it. Um, it's just basically like sex education on steroids for women. And it's just amazing. So she talks about the estrogen balloon, um, which is to do with the eating foods that support your gut, which then supports the bacteria in your vagina so it's the systemic health of your body basically um, not just thinking about the skin on your face and thinking about that as inflammation so definitely give that a read um, and then also bolstering that would be with um, other things that you can look up yourself about progesterone supporting your progesterone production and then also um, anti-inflammatories so when I first started out on my supplement journey about this time last year I was taking just ashwagandha and turmeric and I did notice a difference in my PMS symptoms.